Oh, Debola. Oh, 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 oh. Hello. One night of raving, please. She doesn't know what I'm talking about. All right, I'm just gonna. Oh, the side room doesn't exist anymore. They got rid of the side room for the just quiet drinking and just made the entire place just the dance floor. Well, there you go. If you want to escape from the music, too fucking bad. You don't get a choice now. Oh, yeah. I kind of wish I could make Kyuu dance here. Like, if I just stood here and just, like, held a button, he'd start dancing. And, uh, you know, like, the game that this is going to be a reference that everyone's totally going to get. Scarface, the world is yours. When you go into the club and you hold a button and Tony just starts dancing on the spot. You know, that reference that everyone gets. Hey! Blackjack, I'm literally just stealing shit from behind the DJ tables. <laughs> That's all I'm doing right now. Just stealing their shit. What the? Is these computers? Is this like part internet cafe as well? What the hell's going on here? It's like a wall of computers. Okay, I, I, I guess. I'll go upstairs. Game doesn't want to let me upstairs. Fuck you, video game. I want to go upstairs. There, I will find a way to get up there eventually. Yo, sup? How are you not the bouncer? <laughs> you look bigger than I do. How are you not the bouncer? Actually, I heard you guys are looking for bouncers. And who's the moron spreading that? You can keep this on the down low, right? Yeah. All right then. We run a legit club here, but we got this underground bouncer ring going that takes requests from people around town. Oh, so it's not bouncers for the club. It's bouncers for just. So, what? What? Someone submits a request. I send him one of my boys. I'd say the most common request to get is taking down thugs. So do you just call up bouncer because you're a club and that doesn't raise suspicion? What's going on here? I'm so confused. But things are getting rough lately. Streets are more dangerous than ever. My staff can't hack it. Long story short, yeah, we could use a guy like you. Got even got a job for you right now if you want it. Just swing by when you got the time. I'll make it worth your while, man. So you in? Sure, why not? Great. You got a name? It's Kiryu. Kiryu. You mean like Kazuma Kiryu? Oh, it's so good to have people actually recognize us, especially at this point, considering we've been an ex-fucking chairman of Tojo. People better fucking recognize us. At least some people should. Didn't think I'd be hiring a legend when I got out of bed this morning. Anyway, welcome aboard. Hell yeah. Wait, so I'm sorry, clear. I didn't have to go do bounce up. Worked it. Okay. I got yours. Become the bouncer. Oh, it's like a whole separate thing. Okay. Bouncer missions a special battle request that will take you to uh, specific places to defeat enemies. Devil Bartender will be your contact man for these missions. Talk to him whenever you want to take one on. Oh. Uh, oh. Uh, tiny little crack. My neck is so fucked. Mission progression. Unlock new missions by successfully completing missions. They get more difficult and you get bonuses for completing it the first time. Okay. Same as regular battles. You cannot use recovery items. Okay. You can still change around your armor and accessories. Prepare your inventory and get bouncing. Some have time limits. Um, reach zero or you run out of time. You can also quit a mission by going into that. Uh, grab weapons from crates. Okay. And weapons can't be stored, so go to fucking town with them. All right. Towering giants, normal. Shichifuku parking lot owner. Some giant men have been blocking off the road heading towards Shichifuku parking lot and are asking passersby to pay a price he told to get through. Please stop them. All right. Ugh. Neck is fucked, it doesn't want to crack, and it's really annoying because when it doesn't crack, it feels like it wants to cramp. <laughs> and I'm dizzy when I move my head that much from side to side. It's not the alcohol, I swear. I'm just, I get dizzy easy. <laughs> Alright. Mission start! Oh, nice. Okay. Oh, oh, I'm gonna grab this. Yeah, let's go! <laughs> yeah! Heat move! Nice. Bam. Uh, hell yeah. Get out of here. Look at this. The sides are like super barricaded off and everything. But, yeah. Now get ya. Uh, nice. Bonk. Bonk. Uh. Ow, fuck. There we go. You're gone. Bye. Just punch, punch, punch. Come on. Yeah! Got the throw. Nice. Ow! Asshole! Fuck you! 
Nice. Whoa! People are kicking shit at me. Oh, that one works. There we go. Hello! Bonk. <laughs> I love that one. There we go. Oh, nice. And just kick you while you're down, and... Boom! What? Oh! Oh, this is like... Oh, it's not just one fight. Oh. Whoops. I got confused. Oh. Okay. Are these the crates that they said had shit in them, or is this just... Pardon me, etc. Stuff's flying around everywhere. Okay. I don't think they're the things I was talking about. I think that's just set dressing. Oh, do I punch through this? Oh, yeah, dude. Ah, nice. Oh, fuck, no. Oh, wait. There's a crate. Crate. Oh, it's a knife. It's a fancy butcher knife. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, no, we dealt with this before. Ah. Okay, well, you just didn't even want to do anything. Okay, that works. Oh my god, there's another one. Oh my god, there's another Oh, Oh, okay. Wait, no, I've still got some of this. It's fine. Hurrah! There we go. Oh my god, there's another one past here I can see. Jesus. Bonk. <laughs> oh, no, I dropped shit. Okay. Wait, is there any other, like... So there's a golf club there. I can see that. Is there any down here? No, okay. They're gonna hide weapons like that, yeah. That's what you're meant to use to like, get through these fuckers. Weapons are just the best thing to do on these fuckers. Oh my god, there's a row of three of them up there. Oh fuck. Bonk. Oh god. Okay, I'm gonna go. <laughs> gonna go. <laughs> gonna go grab that fucking. Uh, there it is. Golf club. There we go. Okay. Okay. Okay, is there other weapons around here <laughs> that I can use? There's no crates or weapons I can use. It's just what I've got on me. Okay. <laughs> okay, well I got rid of one, okay. It is possible to hit multiple in one swing, so I want to try and get that to work. Okay. Oh, there's more people behind this. Shit, okay. There we go. There we go. Okay. Okay. Wait, can I re-pick that up after I throw it? No, fuck. Throwing it broke it. Shit, okay. I was thinking to put it down so I could get through this. Oh, God, there's a boss. It's like a fucking boss health bar. Bounce the boss. Oh, God, okay. Uh, Deep move! That worked! Oh, there we go. Oh, God! There's so many barrels of people just kicking them at me from everywhere. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Okay, okay. Oh, God, there's so many people. Oh, God! Oh, God, they do so much damage when they do that. Come on, just not who I wanted to hit with that, but that's fine. Okay. Okay, I still have some heat. I still have some heat. Ow. Yeah, get the heat back. That's what we want. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Okay. 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 We are coming up to problems here. There's a lot of people here. This is... Oh my god! I thought these barrels would, like, help me. Jesus Christ! Fuck off! Do you fucking Christ! Oh my god! Are you serious right now? Get out of- Oh my god! Oh my god! Fuck off! Oh, he just guns for you so hard! Fucking god! Okay! Okay! That last dude just comes up to you and just pummels you into a corner. And there's a billion barrels everywhere, so people are just throwing shit at you constantly. I will come back to that later. My hair is, uh... You know what I need? I need to buy that thing that was like... I need to go to a pawn shop. I need to go to a pawn shop. We need to do that.
Having trouble? Don't forget to train your ability. Okay, yeah, no, I'm gonna come back to that later. <laughs> I'm not gonna worry about that right now. I'll have more moves and, and, and stuff before we come back to it. Because, good God! Up until the end part, it was fine. And then it got to the end part, and it was fucked. Um, okay. I probably won't even worry about doing it this session, but I do want to go to the pawn shop before I forget. Oh, uh, but I still got all these subs. Actually, you know what? We can be down here and like check out food places everywhere. Pawn shop should be this, right? Yeah, it's still in the same place. It'd be super fun. All right, we're going to the pawn shop. We're heading to the pawn shop. No, I'm not fighting you guys. Fuck off. We're heading to the pawn shop, and I can buy that thing. And also, I just will check out all of our stories and shit that we can do down here. That last, that combo that he did to me at the end there lasted for so long. And just like beating me into a corner. It was ridiculous. Like what the hell? <laughs> no one could ever survive. Everyone dies. Ah, oh, this train's so good. Alright. What's up? Hi. Bye. <laughs> bon shot! Let me sell my plate. Hello. You don't Hello. Say it. Well, what will it be today? I am here to sell. Actually, it is also. Remove. I don't, I'm not selling that, no. Wow, my health is actually shit. Okay. Um, where's the stuff that I'm selling? Italian ring. Ah, that's like a special thing from a sub store. I know the point is to sell it, but I kind of don't want to. It's like the same with this. I don't think you can get another one of them. So, nah. Silver plate, though. I should sell my four silver plates. And my three gold plates. And my two iron. You can sell Haruka's marble. That just feels like a dick move. <laughs> why we, Why can you sell her? No, I'm selling the plates. Nothing but the plates. Plates are designed to be sold. You get them for like helping people around town. That's fine. There we go. And a total of 100 million. Uh, 100. 1 million fucking words. Oh my god, what are they? Uh, oh, you sell the ZZ stuff. You don't have many, but you sell some. Actually, wait. Oh no, okay. I saw the two there, I thought that's how many you had. No, it's how many I have. Got it. Okay. Yeah, you've got the, yeah, you've got the Salmon and XX. That's good shit. Um, Bulletproof Vest, plus eight, plus nine. That means okay. Nothing compared. What, like, compared to what um, I want to buy, it's nothing. Body armor. Uh, juice damage from blades. Eight and nine. Leather jacket. Oh, wow. It's actually really good defense-wise, too. And rusted chain mail, which is also really good. All right, well, I'm buying both of those things. Hell yeah. Oh, I can don a leather jacket. Q, you can wear a leather jacket. This game is the best. Um, I know it won't change it. Hey, you can blind it. People with a... You can kill, murder someone with a bowling ball and a silhouette. Oh, my God. I love how it hides the price. Then you go down to it. It's three fucking million. It's a sword that paralyzes enemies. Yeah, no wonder. All right. Well, I'm going to buy this thing. And we, we can equip that. Oh, I have a bit I more defense. Game stop. I'm going to equip that. That'll give us a bit more defense. Um, remove everything. So I want to just focus on the good shit. There we go. That one. Um, eight defense, nine and three, fourteen. Um, five and that. Well, I can put these ones on for now. One of them's gonna have to be replaced with that thing that I I came to the pawn shop to buy. Uh, oh, it's gonna it's gonna want to be the leather jacket. Cause the leather jacket is just the same as the military vest, but it doesn't come with gun resistance. But I want Kiri to wear a leather jacket. <laughs> okay. We're also low on health. I need to go find food places and also write down food places. That's good. Um, there's a bunch down here. Cafe Alps and then Sushi Jun and stuff like that. We're going to go to those places. Hopefully some of them will be good at at least one something. All right. Cafe Alps. Up. I do remember which one's Cafe Alps. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Yo, can I troll behind here? No. There's gonna be a key hiding in one of these places. I can fucking tell. Wait, there's a back door to this place. Looking at the map, there's a back door to this place. Yo, I found your storage room full of boxes and barrels and shit. Man, you can just really just go through fucking places in this. I love it. Why am I letting Gave Elps' break room? And oh! Oh! The Cafe Alps alleyway. We're just in a new alleyway now. 
Oh, okay. Okay. We can just do that. <laughs> nice. A 10 10 one charm. All right, okay. More gambling stuff that I will never use. Nice to know. Okay. Oh my god, I can possibly go up a building here, so. Actually, is this? What did I say? Is this Serena? Oh, obviously not. No. <laughs> But it says, that's that guess for Serena? Literally, how could it be? And this just goes out to this street. Okay. Damn. Okay, now across the road is Serena. Across the road is Serena. Okay. Get in there. Get in there. There we go. There we go. Yo, let's go upstairs. This is not where I meant by stairs. Where the hell am I? I'm so lost. <laughs> okay. Oh, we're at Sexy Club Love Bunny. I have gotten very distracted. Where am I? We have wandered into Love Bunny. Hello. Hi. Can I do anything here? Hello? Okay, I just, I just found a cabaret club. Hello? Hi. How are you all today? Hey, we found a thing. Silver plate, nice. I can also enter the staff only room. I'm just allowed in here. Why can you just go through buildings like this? It's so silly. I don't get me wrong, I like it. I do really like it. It's just, there's so much to explore in this game because you can just wander through buildings. Okay, I can't go out that way. Does this just take me back onto the staircase? It does. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Ah, <laughs> uh, jeez. And this is just back to the first. Was there more past? Love Bunny? Go back this way. Wait, I heard a sound. Oh, it's the elevator. Oh, you can literally just take the elevator to the different places. Okay. So we can just literally, yeah, and that takes us up to Love Bunny, okay. Yeah, because that one was closed off, yeah. There's just so much you can do here! <laughs> Hello! The vignetting indoors is odd, I will say that. <laughs> I'm not sure why it exists. <laughs> Keys! Or oh, maybe just other items. Peelers tile, okay. So I'm guessing a mahjong thing, like a tile. Oh, hello. Sup, what are you doing? You're stuck in an office very late at night, this close to Christmas. What? What's going on, buddy? Actually, speaking of Christmas, I've got shit to show. I've got, I've got exciting things that I can show off because it's Christmas stuff and related. Yeah, this is where, yeah, that was another place that's locked off. Okay. God, there's just, like, why can you do this? Again, I really like it. It's just surprising to me that it's a thing that you can do. Uh, I really, I, I just dig it so much that you can just wander around all these buildings. Oh, I think I, did I come here before? I may have already found this one. I do not remember. Oh, this is Lullaby Mahjong. Okay, this is the Mahjong. <laughs> Little sound as you walk in and out. So yeah, like the back entrance, everything is locked. Dun, dun. Oh no, it's not the, it's a sensor when you walk in the door. Not a sensor on the door, okay. I think I've found that place before. Why is we getting confused with the marshal place and the other one? I do not know. It's been... <laughs> oh, not allowed on the roof of this building. Oh, okay. Okay, whoa, whoa. Wait, can I res Go over the side. Okay, fine, be that way. Don't do that then, fine. Whee. Like, we found a cabaret club, and there's just like, there was one, like, secret item in there, but nothing else to actually do in there. Like, that's just there for shits and giggles. I like that. Cafe Alps, I never actually fucking checked out your menu. Let me have a look at that before I get way too distracted, which I've already done. Do you have good food? I'm also meant to show up yes, stuff yes, this Christmas. Uh, terrible, 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 terrible. Terrible. Terrible! Really bad. Really bad. 
is what we've got there. Anyway, we're gonna watch down there. I got Christmas ornaments from work. Um, they're super awesome, and I love them. And I can't go to the underworld, and that makes me upset. Wait. Oh, this is a fucking hidden, hidden vending machine. Uh, okay. We're gonna stop once we're at the front of this street here. Uh, okay. Okay. Oh my god, I found a fucking staircase I can go up. Wait, is there anything up here? No. Okay. Okay. While we're up here, I gotta show off some things. So I got, um, we got in like a shitload of these things called Hallmark keepsakes at work. They're like Christmas ornaments, all different licensed properties and shit. I got two of them because I couldn't help myself. The first one. Ah! It's a Legend of Zelda NES cartridge. Look at it. Look at it. It's made out of metal too. Like that is like, oh, I guess microphone. That's like a solid metal Christmas tree ornament. You can tell it's an ornament because it's going to go really badly on the camera that what you see. There's a little ring on the top of it here to like hang it from there. And it's just a nice gold NES cartridge for Legend of Zelda. A game that I did really like when I played it. So that's cool. That's cool. You should still have full health when you uh, heal at, um, when you die and come back with full health. But yeah. <laughs> Sorry, if you haven't been onto those videos and you've seen the war of comments about it and uh, the fact that one of my stalkers came from that series and badmouthed me on various parts of the internet still about that opinion, uh, you won't get it as much. Another Christmas ornament that I got with that though is... It's a little NES! The ring on this one is weird because it's designed to hold that way because it's on top of the controller here. That's the ring that you hold it by, so it hangs like that, which is a bit weird. But if you look on the front here, we're playing Yakuza. Ready? Ready? Oh, look at that. And if I get it really close, it's Mario Bros. It's a little Mario Bros in there. <laughs> but that's not all, because it has the little power button down there. And when I press the power button... Is that not the coolest Christmas tree ornament you've ever seen in your entire fucking life? <laughs> so they were $30 each Australian. I work at the place, so I got a 25% discount. I may not have bought them if I didn't. Um, so the thing is, now that I have them, I'd consider it worth it. Um, this is the heaviest keepsake out of all of them, and it was metal. Which is why I bought it. Because I'm just like, all the others felt like they were made out of, like, light plastic. Um, because they were bigger than the, um, than the cartridge and stuff like that. This one had a weight to it, so I was like, okay, it's metal, so it's probably, like, a good quality one and stuff like that. So I got that one, and then after I got that, I took it home, and I realized what good quality it was. I'm just like, okay, that's actually pretty good. And looking around the other ones when we got the next delivery in the next day, I saw this one, and I'm just like, okay, oh, pick up the box. Oh, the box is really light. Uh, it's probably not that great. I look on the back of the box, batteries included... And I'm just like, okay, if it has batteries, then that means it either lights up or makes sounds. And, well, it does. And that's amazing. So, I just had to show those off. And, well, they're on my table right now because I bought them over the last two days. And you know what? This this series has Christmas in it. So that's a good excuse. I'll make the session a little bit longer. Like, I'll go to two, two hours, ten minutes to make up for the fact that I spent ten minutes on that. But I should probably make it way longer because I, I spent 15 minutes in a fucking convenience store. But we're not worrying about that. We're buying more food. And so I'm talking about wasting time. Okay. So what have we got? What do we got? Is it down here? I guess it's down here. Yo, oh, which place is this? I thought we were going to Sushi Gym. This is not Sushi Gym. Yorono Taki stuff. Okay. Sashimi plied up. Terrible. 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 So I don't even pay attention to the pictures and the descriptions anymore. What this Yakuza game has taken away from me. Taken away how good the photos are, and I like all the descriptions that they give. Because I'm just worried about, but what about the stats it gives me? That is straight up actually times three. For the skewer platter. That is straight up just times three. I don't know if it's worth it, because the other one gave you a lot more hunger, so I didn't have to take as long doing it. 
Um, terrible, 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 terrible. It's all... It's all terrible. It's all... It's all garbage! It's all garbage! Arigatou gozaimasu! Uh, doesn't have as good food as Sotenbori. Is what I'm learning here. There was multiple places in Sotenbori that were actually kind of decent. Ah, oh, my nose sucks. Ugh. Colin is just really fucking with me. Fuck it. I only ever had... Ah, this is sushi. I only ever had fucking... Um, hay fever problems in Melbourne, and this one summer in Sydney has been the worst. Sushi Jen. Alright, Sushi Jen is a good place. We knew the people here. Oh, look! Nishiki said. Nishiki, the name still brings back memories. That's a different Nishiki. But hey. Wow. Wow. I mean, he died like a year ago. Of course, it would still bring back memories. Wow. Wow, what a description. That's a lot across the board. <coughs> like, that's... Oh. Uh, I guess, like, times it by 10, you get, like, 80 and 70 and 100, 130. I mean, if you want everything, that's all right. Um, nothing amazing. Kawami set's pretty good at everything. More on the stuff that I want, which is the... Um, yellow, green, and purple. And also, it's Kawami. Da no. So, like, some of the food is just downright dog shit. And this gives you basically nothing. Um, okay, this place is okay. The Nishiki and Kawami sets. Arigatou oh, oh, that. Yeah. Actually, was it Zero or Kawami that we helped out the dude there? No, it was Zero, because the, that was the friendship meter and everything. Oh. There's, okay, there's no actual food places up here. Okay, well, there's those ones in the corner, but they're far away. There's actually a sub-story that we did, that we passed that was at the bottom of Nakamichi Street. Is it Nakamichi? No, hey, Nakamichi Street. I actually remember that shit. Oh, my God. I am actually remembering the layout of the city. Oh, my God. Oh, is it you? Hello? Hmm. And she calls me you, son. Uh, uh y yeah, how'd you know? It's a pleasure finally making your acquaintance. I am Suninaga, the headmistress of... Oh! Oh, shit. Kazuma-san built that orphanage. Nishiki, me, Yumi, and later, Haruka. We all grew up there. Is this about Haruka? Is having her there causing you any trouble? Trouble? I don't know, quite the opposite. If anything, the orphanage is never so bright as when she's around. That's a relief. But if you don't mind me asking, what happened to the old caretaker? Oh, he was having a spot of health trouble, so he made the difficult decision to move back to, um, to his family in the country. I've taken over in his absence. I see. What brings you out to the city? This isn't the safest part of town. Oh, well, I'm ashamed to admit to you of all people, but money's been getting tight lately. After Kazuma-san passed, things have been getting difficult, to say the least. Yeah, I imagine there's not many other people in Tojo who would be willing to fork over the money to that place the way he did. I'm sorry to hear that. Kashiwagi-san stepped in as our benefactor, but despite his best efforts, he's just too busy to spare us much attention. Oh, wow, Kashiwagi actually... I guess that makes sense. Like, it, ma it makes sense. I just figured he would, like, be like, oh, whatever. <laughs> but, he, yeah, he did look up to Kazuma a lot, so that makes sense. I know it's all to ask of you, but if you have any love for the orphanage shield, do you think you could assist us with an occasional donation? Hmm. I owe everything to Sunflower and Kazuma-san. I can't promise I'll be much help, but I'll certainly contribute what I can. You will? Thank you so much. I make regular trips to Camarocho to pick things up, so you can talk to me anytime you'd like to make a donation. Or if it's more convenient, you can use any ATM in a convenience store. Oh, uh. those things actually do that. So that sounds easy enough. Just out of curiosity, how much are you thinking you'll need? No amount would be too large, but I think somewhere in the ballpark of 500,000 yen would keep us to float as far as basic living expenses go. That's not much at all for what I've got. Thank you again, Kiryu-san. Aww, it's a nice sub-story to support the power of an edge. Sui Naga needs 50k to help keep the orphanage up and running. I should donate when I can. Oh, hell yeah. No, I'm going to do that right now. Hi. It's great news. Simply wonderful. 100,000. <laughs> I can't say how much of a help you are to the children. Thank you. Hmm? Something wrong? Oh, Kiri's son. The orphanage regularly took in this boy about Haruka's age. His name is Hay um, Hayato-kun. His dad is like... Possibly a stand user and... Okay, I guess I'm not even going to continue. He's a troubled child, and he's not made a single friend yet. I'm quite worried about him. It can be tough to acclimate to an orphanage situation. The other kids are treating him well, right? They're doing their best. 
But he makes it a point to keep his distance. They can only do so much. You were an orphan once, Kiryu son. Do you have any suggestions? Have uh, talk with him, find something he's interested in, wait and see what happens. Interest. An interest is what I'd say. Hmm. I suppose that might make him open up a bit. I wonder what that would be. Did you get any details where you took him in? Where he's from? What his hobbies are? Anything? Mm. Apparently, he did used to take care of the class pet at his old school. It's possible he has a soft spot for animals. Sounds like that's your answer. We don't have any pets at Sunflower. Well, that won't do. Should have a pet there anyway. That'd be nice. Where could I possibly find a pet? Is that actually just the sub, the sub story goal? Huh. It's actually not appearing on my sub story list there. Okay. Oh, Haruka! <laughs> uh, Headmistress told me about your idea for helping. Ha hey, it's so good. Cool. Do you remember the puppy we saved last year? Yo! Yo! Yes! Get that puppy back! Oh my god! <laughs> I bet the guys from Purgatory can track down a dog. I'll give him a Goozle a call. Hello? Hey, Magusa. This is Kiryu. Ah, Kiryu-san. Not a man I expect to get a call from. What's going on? Actually, I reckon I let a dog loose in the city last year before we left. You didn't happen to keep a track of it, did you? Keep track of it? I kept the little guy. Ah. Would you be willing to part with him for some kids? They need a pet at Sunflower Orphanage. Oh, ain't that the orphanage Haruka grew up at? That's the one. Would you be willing? Or did you get too attached? Well, for you, Kiryu-san. For the kids, and for this little guy's happiness, I'll do it. Meet me at the theater. I mean, I don't want to take a guy's dog, but... <laughs> okay. Okay, theater square, right? Theater square, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Is said theaters? I'm just like, I'm assuming theater square. I haven't eaten yet, have I? I've still got fuck all health. Hmm. Smile Burger, Fuji Soba. Okay. We'll stop by those places as well. We need to find somewhere that's good. For, like, more than just the two stats that I'm running. <laughs> I mean, there's a place that's good for green. I forget where that was. Oh, it was Ringer Hut still. <laughs> have you got good food here at Smile Burger? No. 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 Is that? Wait. Wait. Let me walk out of this building now for a second. No, there are different places. <laughs> that's it. No, that's where it was. I saw. I was about to say. I feel like I stopped by a burger joint before. Yeah. Yeah. The King Burger maybe. It's like wait. I I feel like I did this already. <laughs> All right, uh, Fuji Soba. We'll stop by there then. Which is oh, it's yeah. wait. Is it this one? No. Look on the map and work out where I am, and not be an idiot. I can work it out. Hi, sup? Hi there. Uh, terrible, terrible, terrible. That's really bad. Terrible, 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 terrible. Everything sucks here. All the food in Kamarocho is bad, it turns out. All right, well, there's like three places in the corner here and the wet kitchen. Uh, and if not, we'll go to Ringer Hut and just eat the green. Because <laughs> that seems to be our best spot, best luck at this point. Wait, New York Hot Dog? Can I go in there? No. Oh, the entrance places to the arcade, obviously. Is there food places inside of Millennium Tower? Well, I guess Ringer Hut's underground and it's still selling it there. So I guess not. There's a lot of food places around there, though. But we're not heading that direction. We're heading this direction. So we're going to go over here. I check out the several food joints that are right on the corner here. Yo, sup? It's another takeaway yes, joint. It. Wait, is this one the one that's at the top? Stop. This one's the one that's at the top. Yeah, Akashimaru. Yup, okay. Cool, okay. Uh, oh, Gendako! Gendako, I know Gendako. And Wild Jackson. Alright. Ah, uh, yeah, it's the little hole in the wall! Yeah, that you get your face on the street with! Oh, they got Takayaki too. Um, okay. No, no. Their food's still not good. It's still not good. I'd just eat that though. I, I, sour cream and chips is good. No. 
No. No. No. No. I love this image of this cock uh, of this um Kaku highball. Look at that. That's just an awesome picture for it. But no. 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 No, but it's a gym beam, so I'm going to buy it. <laughs> Wait, I'm actually licensed gym beam. Let's go. Also, I think that's a gym beam and ginger. Like, oh, lemonade. That might be lemonade. Because that is not gym beam and coke. Which is, if you get gym beam here. Thank If you got gym beam in a pub here, you'd absolutely, if you didn't ask what you wanted it, if you didn't say what you wanted it with, you'd absolutely get it with coke. That looks like either ginger or lemonade. I keep forgetting that a lot of other countries don't have Coke as the standard fixer for alcohol. Yes, I don't know if that's um, only an Australian thing or if there's not many other countries that do it, but I know there's a bunch of countries where it's lemonade that is the standard mixer for alcohol, which is just not the case here. Okay, uh, no, no. See, it's all fucking fast food, so it's all terrible. That being said, I want this in real life. Um, chicken sandwich. No, no. It all sucks. Arigatou all the How is Ringer Hut the best thing here? Stay away still. Alright, wet kitchen. There's people in the way. I'm going to die again. So before it was just eat at the places that you haven't eaten at. Now it's find the good places to eat at. Oh my god, it is more fucking takeaway. Are you fucking serious? Okay. Okay. Alright, a wet burger. Okay. No, 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 no. So some of these might be a yes in terms of total points across all of them. But I'm worried about more... I'm, I'm focusing more on specific stats. Alright, well, we'll stop by the Ringer Hut because it's on the bloody way. And it's good for the green, which... Actually, do I need more green right now or do I need more yellow? I need more green, actually. What am I? Am I using yellow for stuff? Uh, actually, if I want to boost heat actions, I need, I need yellow. Also, need purple. Nowhere is good for purple in terms of food. It seems. Everything sucks. Um. <laughs> see, a lot of battle skills. Uh, yeah, like heavy attack max. This, that's all green. There's, yeah, if it's battle skills, there's not many that eat yellow other than throws. It seems. But even finishing hold mastery is not that. Ooh, quick step distance. Ooh, I, I'm gonna get that. If I can get level one of that for free, I'll fucking take it. How does everywhere here for food suck? Seriously. I know we haven't gotten around to like the other half of the town, but still though, fuck me. They're all bad. <laughs> Don't fight me. I'm going underground. I'm eating a burger. Fuck off. I guess I am technically under the influence slightly, so there might be more people. Bring a hut! Save me! Save me! I don't know if they can enter the underground place. <laughs> ah, get, get fucked on! Alright, Veggie. Veggie gives me a little bit of... This. I saw nothing that even gave half decent purple anyway. Because this gives me no purple. No, it does give me, though, it does give me a little bit of blue, which is nice. Because blue is also something I need for moves. So that, that that's good. All right, we'll eat, we'll eat this, and then we'll get, we can go do the orphanage thing. We'll get around to doing the, you know, doing all the stuff in the town eventually. Oh, I've also got to buy that thing. i got to buy the thing. I, did, I, did I even go to the pawn shop? I did, okay. There's so many things I'm trying to keep a track of. I want to do this. I want to do that. And yeah, it's it's gone great. It's gone great. I'm good. I'm good at video games. Okay, come on. And then I'm on 81. Fuck. Okay. Well, I can't. It's gonna. I'm gonna be one short at the very end of being able to max out my stomach. But that's fine. Okay. Okay. Veggie field soup. There we go. Just keep eating this. And this gives me 400 green. That's a pretty good amount of green, I think. By the end of this. Like, that's good. It just takes forever. See, part of me is just, I should get to a point where... 
I kind of just, I'm not focusing on any one particular thing right now. I kind of just want a lot of a lot of different things. I should just get into fights when I'm out of food, go to the nearby place and just eat one of everything at once so it's quick. And also I might be able to get completion points on places by just eating it. Like if I just go here, right? Like if I just eat all this, do I get... Damn it. Okay. Oh! Oh, it actually, like, overfills you. Oh, you can actually be overfull. Okay. Okay. You can overeat, and then it will probably just take forever to wear it down again. Okay. I was going to say, if I just ate everything, would I get the completion bonus for it, even if it doesn't provide me with bonuses? Or do I need to eat everything and get the stats from it to get completion bonuses for stuff? Puppy dog! Oh my god! The puppy's back! Oh my god! <laughs> Out of all the characters to bring back from Z from Kawami, I'm so happy it's the dog. <laughs> oh, Giri son, looking good, man. It's been a while. How have you been? Not bad. Me and Pochitaro uh, he became pretty good friends after last year. Pochitaro, isn't that the name Haruka gave him? <laughs> Hello. Hey, <laughs> you've gotten bigger. I think Pochitaro is gonna love these kids just as much as they love him, Kiryu san. It's about time he got off the streets. I guess that's probably part of the reasoning for him of why he's more okay with it, because it's just like, it's still technically a homeless dog. <laughs> Thanks for this, Magusa. That's actually like a very nice thing to do. Like, that's actually super nice. Having a dog for a year, you would absolutely get very, very attached to the dog. So it's actually an incredibly nice thing. Is he like part of my inventory now? Is that what it is? Okay, I was about to say, if he's in my inventory, that's hilarious. No. <laughs> okay. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. Magusa, you're good. You're good. I mean, the homeless people in general in the game are very good people. <laughs> who just get absolutely fucked on, and Kiri was someone who has more of a capacity to do something about it. Yeah, she's still down here. Then others doesn't do enough, but yeah, it's blah, blah, whatever. Whatever. Hello! Dude, like even across the way there's like so many neon lights on like the other half of camera or across the main street. Kiryu san! Oh! Who's this little guy? Hello! His name's Pochitaru. Haruka looked after him um, for a little while last year after we saved him from some punks. She really did that? How kind of her. Will you be able to, um, will you be able to accommodate him at Sunflower? Having a dog there would lift everyone's spirits. Including higher tokens. Of course I would. Are you sure it's all right though? Absolutely. Your orphanage is the best place for him. Better than the streets. Oh, thank you so much, Kiryu-san. This is gonna make the kids so happy. You be good over there, Pochitaru. <coughs> ah, it's a puppy. Ah. Ah. Okay. Hi, Uncle Kaz. Thanks for finding Pochi for me. Hayatukun loves dogs. You already took Pochi for a walk. Five seconds ago. A photo of Pochitaru! Yo! Yo! Yo, is that my album? Okay. It's not in the album. I guess it's in my um, valuables. Photo! Yeah! <laughs> Look at the little puppy! <laughs> oh, it's so good. Hello. Pochitaru has really brought some life back to Sunflower. More importantly, he's helped higher to couldn't start getting to know the other children. Sounds like Pochitaro is living the high life over there. This really is the best case scenario. Thank you so much, Kiryu san. Don't thank me. Thank Pochitaro. Hi! Hey. Ha, ah, of course. And if you ever feeling generous, we're still accepting donations, of course. Yay! Yay, Sunflower. Yay, Sunflower. Plenty of sub stories get you a lot of the purple, it seems. Hello? I'm, I'm curious if there's extra benefits you get for continuing to help out, um, what's it called? Sunflower? Like, do you get more as it goes on? So doing that? Oh, bump of the microphone, don't mind me. God, there's so many sub-stories I'm in the middle of doing. Okay, so, oh yeah, it's the underwear. I was gonna buy it, I'm gonna buy the really old underwear for it from the Dragon Palace. <laughs> That's right, I remember this now. Okay, um, uh, and I also need to do something in public park three, was it? Yeah, yeah, I'm grabbing a key from the dude who's got the winky emails. Yeah, yeah, I'm remembering shit. Don't worry. Don't you worry. It's an extra instance. 
Don't you worry. I know what I'm doing. We go down here. And there's something somewhere in here. Hey, what's up? Sorry, it's over here. Probably that. Probably that. Camera to locker key. See one. Time to go see what's in that locker. I kind of don't want to do that directly right now in case it does a whole thing. Nah. Wait. Majima, what the fuck? Oh. Oh. Oh, there's no Majima in that one. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. Should I do that now? Nah. 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 Now nah, we'll go up to the thing and we'll buy a thing. One session there. Actually, you know what? It would be good because we're going we're to fight that dude. We're going to fight that dude. So we'll go up there and we'll fight the dude. Well, we won't fight the dude, but we'll buy the stuff. And we'll have like an extra powerful item to get ready to then fight the dude. I'm assuming like the sub story's back. So I'm assuming it's going to be fighting that guy again. Unless there was another sub story there that I could, not, that I could do that I missed. Um, it's going to be one of the two. Ah, uh, poor Maharaja. Is that the name of the place? The dancing place? Oh my god, there's battles everywhere. I know I should be battling people because hunger and stuff, but you know. It is how it be. Now, what floors were these all on? We started on three, so I want to say the buying stuff was on two. If my memory serves me correctly, which there is no way that it would but let's see how it goes up yo take a look at what i got eye of the dragon hell yeah super powerful which was the underwear there it is i just want to see if that works i'm a, i'm willing to spend the twenty two thousand on it to see if it works just to give the guy the underwear because that would be hilarious got 10 different types of gear couple more stats from that how much am i oh wow i've got like a lot on purple actually i should probably learn some shit hey do I want to do heat damage moves even further right now? Fox and Project out now? Or um, do I want to focus on like learning shit? Actually, purple doesn't really use on learning battle skills. It's learning heat. Actually, it's not even learning heat moves. Okay, it's learning the, the ally heat moves. Well then, hell yeah, let's get this. Hell yeah, let's get that. Bam. And we can max it out. It's actually like not that much really to get that. Okay, um... Finishing old mastery, let's go! Learn 10 skills, giving me even more points back. Hell yeah. Um, light attack 2 is more yellow. Heavy attack, more. Quick step distance. Yeah, I need a lot of blue and green to learn my moves. Learn lunge. Lunge is cheap. While I'm running, I can do a dodge. <gasps> Yo, leaping attack from a lunge. Oh, I'll take that. It's actually really cheap. Uh, enhanced counter? Why not? Just if I attack someone while they're doing that? Okay. Oh, okay. I need I need an, uh, more of the attack limit to get that one. So I'll worry about that later. Um, okay. I kind of want just like the normal boosting damage ones there as, as well as this one. I, I might just save my purples for this one. Because that's just a really... Like if I can just get even more damage on my hate moves, that's just sick. Um, cause it's stuff that down here, yeah, that needs a lot of purple too, but that's when we go back to Sotenbori, which I imagine is going to be a while, especially if I'm doing all the sub stories here first before we do that. Cause boy, this has been over two hours and I am like hardly through the sub stories at all. Also, we need to equip this. So yeah, like that gives us gun resistance, but do I need, no, I'd rather wear a leather jacket right now. Hell yeah. So that just gives us extra health and attack and shit. Whoa, that's a much bigger jump than I was expecting. Oh my god. Look at that jump. Look at how much extra that gives me. That activates like a whole other bar for the heat gauge. Damn. So when it says plus 12, it must mean like... Yeah, it must mean like the equivalent of multiple of those then. For plus 12. Oh shit, okay. That must be what that means then. Like it's the equivalent of 12 points in this. Damn, okay. Shit. <laughs> Nice. Okay. Okay, well, I'm definitely keeping that on. Absolutely keeping that on. So, is the other dude here? Or is there a different substory that I missed? Is over here. Crack the net. Hey, Zoba. Oba is indeed back. Yep, and he's the substory. Well, we'll punch the shit out of Oba on the next episode. We'll do that then, and... Oh my god, there's so many substories that I still need to get around to in this step. Is that just how it's gonna be? I haven't even gone to, like, the entire east side of the town. I haven't even been there in any capacity. 
But, you know, in due course, we will do that. Um, and, you know, we'll spend a lot of time eating at Ringer Hut to get all of the... Um, to get all of the green. Part of me wants to go around town, like, off video and just, like I did in Certain Bori, and just work out what good places there are to eat at. But I don't want to accidentally activate sub stories and shit while I'm walking around, because that's more likely here, because there's so many more sub stories. And I haven't been around the town where before I basically finished everything before I did that. So I probably won't do it. But next episode, we'll fight Ober and then do a bunch of other shit. So, until then, this is version 2. Signing out.